thinks he's all that. You want the twins, right? You want to get close enough to count the nose hairs? Well, I got a way to do that. Now, normally, I just walk you up and introduce you to the twins straight off. But I'm on the outs with them right now. Told them they were fucking up and they got all huffy. It's a whole thing. That's not important. What's important is that now, the twins are all over this guy Frank. Like he's their best friend or something. They even made him the fucking warden of the prison. You believe that? Well, they know me and him don't get along. He's such a dick. But what it is is, Lou has a thing for me. And she wants to make me jealous, okay? Now, why else would they even talk to that asshole? So the number one part of the plan is, you gotta kill Frank. And here's how we do it. He's the prison warden, right? So I take you to the prison as a prisoner. That gets you close to Frank, and you just fucking take him out. Take that motherfucker out. I'll explain the rest of the plan on the way. Trust me, it's sure fire. Just stash your gear here. The prisoners don't got weapons. Then jump in the truck, and I'll drive you in. If we catch the Edeners out there putting a herding on the highway, hey, land, what do you know? Orange is your color. Up on those Hop in the back, let's go. So you're wondering how killing Frank gets you close to the twins, right? Uh, the Demolition Derby's coming up. The winner of the Derby gets invited to the fancy-ass dinner with all the highwaymen bigwigs. Win the Derby, and you got an express ticket to the Twins' personal space. The problem is, the Derby's got all the drivers they need. We gotta open up a spot in the lineup. Well, guess what? Frank's all set to drive in the Derby. That's right. You see the genius of the plan? You take Frank out, and boom! Suddenly, the Derby's a driver short. So happens, I know a guy who's tight with a gal. Anyway, I can get you that spot on the Derby. But first, Frank's gotta go. I guess without any weapons, you'll have to improvise a way to kill that motherfucker. I'll let you work out the details. <laughs> Imagine that, little fucker in his garbage truck. Hope you got something good in the truck fed there, little fucker. Hope it's worth our fucking while. The hell you want, little fucker? Hey, nice to see you too, jeez. I got a prisoner with me, what do you think? Mm. It's your ass in the weeds if they're a problem. Bring him in. it up in there, okay, Slick? Don't die.
fingers up. Oh, it's got a conscience somewhere. And they may as well start with you. Just pray they don't end with you, too. <laughs> Just keep your head down. Get through the day. Survive the day. Hey, turn off. That sure as shit isn't working. This really makes me feel like the bombs never dropped. Lou, they can't tell you anything if you cut out their tongues. Plenty of tongues where those came from. Those shits gave the rabbit something, and I want to know what it is. I'm with you on that, but they can't tell you anything unless you ask more questions. Let me handle this. I know what I'm doing. I hate to barge in. We're busy! I, I know, but somebody who looks important wants to talk. How important? I don't want to hear this. This is on the control. I'll handle this one. <laughs> the fuck you still doing here? Maybe if I pretend to be dead, they'll dump my body outside and I can escape. I finally got my car running again. And then I got caught just driving down the road. I know how to get out of here. I know which one has the key back inside. They took my shiv to the restricted zone. I could try and get it, take him out. My goddamn legs would stop shaking if I had the guts. I'm never gonna understand this music. Just a few more days. A few more days and I'll try breaking out of here again.
something. Slick, you like a ghost in the night up here. I knew you were the one for the job. Just popped in there like a fart on the breeze and got everything we need. Now it remains to be fucking seen if you can drive worth a damn.
Holy fucking moly! I got your back. That asshole in his fucking pride. I cannot overstate how much I wanted Frank to die. Thank you. Can't believe that idiot thought he could drive in the Derby. I could drive in the Derby. I could run the Derby. I know more about cars than any of them. I once built a car out of nothing but a kitchen sink. That spot in the Derby is yours now. And that's gonna get you up close and personal with Mickey and Lou. All I gotta do is finagle you a halfway decent set of wheels and you're good to go. Look, we don't wanna be seen hanging around together. So you gotta move on out of here. Now don't worry, I'll be in touch real soon. Thank <laughs> you.